Welcome to Hospice Malta, celebrating 25 years of quality service. Together, we are hospice. Established as the Malta Hospice Movement in 1989, Hospice Malta is a voluntary, non-profit organisation specialising in free palliative care for patients with life-threatening illnesses. Hospice Malta's founding members drew their inspiration from the work of Dame Cicely Saunders, who opened Britain's first modern hospice in 1967. Hospice Malta continues to model itself on her shared ideals of care, compassion and dignity for every individual in need. Many people would ask, what is palliative care and why is it different to general hospital care? Palliative care is specialised medical care for people with serious illnesses. It is focused on providing patients with relief from the symptoms, pain and stress of a serious illness. A World Health Organization statement describes palliative care as an approach that improves the quality of life of patients and their families facing the problems associated with life-threatening illness through the prevention and relief of suffering by means of early identification, impeccable assessment and treatment of pain and other problems, physical, psychosocial and spiritual. Hospice Malta cares for hundreds of patients and their families every year. Most of our patients have cancer, while a small number have motor neurone disease and other life-threatening illnesses. Each individual case is treated with utmost care and confidentiality and patients come from all over the Maltese Islands. Our services to patients and their families are all free of charge. We welcome everyone and value them as unique individuals, whatever their race, religion or lifestyle. There are many complex and varied issues for patients and their families to cope with in the face of serious illness and it can be very difficult and distressing for both to come to terms with such a situation. Our patients need help and support and this is why our services aim to address not only physical needs but also psychological, social and spiritual issues. Therefore, our services are delivered by a multi-professional team together with an essential backup of many volunteers. Around 160 volunteers are currently offering time and dedicated service to Hospice Malta. Many of them have been giving this loving commitment for over 10 years. Our volunteers are an extension of the work of the professional staff and are an important part of Hospice Malta's mission to offer effective help and relief whenever and wherever possible. Our volunteers are organised in teams or groups according to the area of work of their own choice and according to their specialist skills and abilities. From drivers transporting a patient for hydrotherapy sessions to assisted bathing, home visits and guidance for family carers and relatives. Just as a sunflower needs the sun's energy, Hospice Malta needs everyone's help in order to keep offering its valuable services free of charge. What about donations and fundraising? As a voluntary non-profit organisation, we receive around one quarter of our funding from the Department of Health, but we always need to raise the balance to maintain our present levels of quality service. This can only be achieved with the combined efforts of our management, staff, volunteers, and of course, the benevolent generosity of the Maltese public. All donations go towards ensuring the continuation of utilities and services to patients in Malta and Gozo and includes specialised medical, nursing and therapeutic services, control of pain and other symptoms, delivery and loan of specialised equipment, as well as emotional, social and spiritual support to the patient and family. Accountability is paramount at Hospice Malta. All donations are greatly appreciated and carefully managed to ensure quality services and equipment are available to the patient. Hospice Malta's ultimate goal is to continue providing quality palliative care and end-of-life care and support to patients with life-threatening illnesses, whilst providing essential support to the patient at home, by extension to the new oncology centre at Mater Day Hospital. Ultimately, Hospice Malta is working very hard to raise the funding needed to establish an inpatient palliative care centre totally dedicated to end-of-life care for all. This would be a first for Malta, a dedicated inpatient hospice where specialised palliative care can be provided to the patient 
once home care is no longer an option. A dignified solution for patients and their families. Get involved. Support Hospice Malta by becoming a member, a volunteer or by donation. Together, we are hospice. Visit hospicemalta.org for more details.